Hey everyone, how's it going? I'm Steph. Welcome back to the Secret Slob Challenge. Every day this month, I am decluttering a different area of my house and I hope you are too. So today is kind of a smaller project for me, but I know it could be big for other people. You never know where people have their clutter. And it's our purse and wallet or handbag. So this is my purse and my wallet's inside and it's totally packed with stuff. So I'm gonna take some time to go through that. So today's project is kind of small, but it's really a good time to think about how clutter came to be in your house in the first place, because it's not like a dump truck of clutter came backed up and dumped it all in your house. It really accumulates slowly starting in these small spaces and then as those overflow, we start filling other spaces and then as those overflow, our bare surfaces, countertops and tables get filled, it happens slowly. And so we kind of have to go backwards and declutter slowly as well. So take the time to go through some of these smaller spaces you might not be thinking of because every little thing makes a difference and every little thing adds up. So if you don't have a ton of time today, this could be a perfect one to work on. Oh, I totally almost forgot to mention that every single day of this challenge all month long, I'm giving away a $100 gift card to a local store in your area. I want you to tell me the store. We're going to support small local businesses all month long and get motivated to declutter our houses. So all you have to do to enter is subscribe to the channel, leave a comment below, and I'm going to pick a winner every day. I hope it's you, but if not, I hope you just made some progress on decluttering your house and then it's a win for everyone. Okay, let's get started. So this is my purse. I love this purse. It was a thrift store find, believe that. So I'm gonna go quickly and see what's in here. Bag of pistachios, good. <laughs> I feel like I'm finding diapers everywhere in this house and I'm just so relieved to finally get rid of them. My son is totally potty trained. He is doing great. So don't need these. Okay, so here's my pal. I'm gonna quickly collect these. Lottery tickets. I don't really gamble, but I have a serious lottery ticket addiction. I don't know why, I just always felt like I was gonna win one day. And I don't really drink and I don't smoke and I don't really spend money on many other things. So I do purchase lottery tickets, but they kind of collect in my purse. And these are just receipts, garbage, socks. Just like a bunch of loose pistachios, my watch. If you have children, you probably have little trucks in your purse or your bag. Okay, so what can actually go back in here? So I'm gonna put my coins in my wallet when I do my wallet. Pistachios, no. Wet wipes, I have three kids, yes. Lip gloss. Yes, but this one I'm gonna leave here in the house. Pen, throat drops, I like to have those. My lottery ticket, which I'll put in there. And my car, which I'll put back there. And my sunglasses. And just like that, the purse is basically empty. So much better, and that like was so easy. Okay, next thing is I wanted to just quickly go through my wallet, more lottery tickets. I feel like you guys are learning There's so much about me. <laughs> So going through my wallet, I have a seriously huge stack of cards. I just don't feel like I need to carry all of these around with me every single day. You know, I have one credit card, I have one bank card. A lot of these are like gift cards. I guess I need air miles. Gift cards, okay. That's garbage. Like hotel, frequent hotel point card. Ooh, a free coffee. Oh, hotel card, hotel card. I used to work at a job where I stayed at a lot of hotels and so I got the hotel cards and then I would collect points and get free nights. It worked really well, actually. I have two of these Air Miles cards, credit cards. <gasps> Another free coffee, what? I am rich, yay. Services card, I need that gift card. And then children's health cards, which don't need to be in my wallet. Okay, without sharing my personal information, this is the stack of things that I'm going to keep, and this is the stack of things that is going to go in a filing cabinet in my filing system that I started, which is great. And I'm gonna put these in here. Perfect. Okay, and then a little bit of money, and then my lottery ticket collection. I'm like kind of embarrassed to share that, but whatever. We all have our things that we like. Put this money in the bag. And there we go. My wallet has everything I needed it and nothing more. My purse has everything I needed it and nothing more. 
that was so easy just a really simple task declutter an area of my life that you know i just don't always think about but it is another source of clutter and another source of headache especially when i can't find things so take the time today to go through your wallet your purse your backpack your kids school bags your diaper bag i'm looking at you new mamas because those things can get seriously cluttered um just any space where it's kind of a handbag you're carrying around you'll be so much happier and you'll probably find a special hidden treasure you didn't even know was there. Okay, that's it for today. Simple. Probably have a huge project to work on tomorrow. I will see you then. Bye-bye.